Hello and good evening. My name is John. We're here playing Search All Candy as part of my Steam Cleaning series. We're going to regain my Steam library eventually. Then arbitrarily rate and or review them for the playtime. I don't know quite what the game is, but the game's out at random. But I believe in this one we are searching for all the candy. I appreciate the animated elements to this. Is that a... I don't know if the moving elements can ever have uh, clickables on it. Also, that feels like that should be candy. All right. So it's just a little bit finicky on those hitboxes there. A real, real bit of bummerness. We're trying our best to tag all these items here. This is part of the long-running Search All franchise. These games... Wow, that is tough to hit. Like, I feel like this is a candy right there. Maybe I'm wrong. But it looks just like that one, just placed in a different location. Let me move down a little bit. Where? There's your hitbox. I'm gonna say that so far this has been a very poor hitbox experience, more more so than any other games in the series. Not sure what it is, but I am zoomed in all the way I can go, trying to get the hip hitboxes the best chance they can get. As you can see, I'm struggling with it a fair bit. Let's keep on finding them. That candy cane must not be a candy in this situation. They must mean purely a wrapped candy. Uh, I do recommend, whenever possible, sticking to wrapped candies. I'm not a big fan of loose candies in a bowl. That's me personally. I don't want to yuck anyone else's literal yum here. I wish I could click on this. There we go. Not sure what the issue is with the mouse here, but it's definitely not registering on the tip of the mouse. Maybe there's just an offset on the, on the mouse that's causing trouble there. There's one up there. Over it slightly and we'll keep on going. There we go. There's a total of 80 uh, candies to find and we're making great progress here. I don't know what's that wrong with that seam. I don't think it's going to show up on stream. A little bit on the recording that is, but there seems to be an issue with the animated seam there. Um, there's some there and, uh, you know, they're hidden by the Animations as much as I pr praise them. That is part of the, the challenge is keeping it. There is definitely a seam in here, too. Check those seams. You've got to play your games at multiple resolutions because seams are very noticeable if the, you don't. Let's keep going here. We're at 63. I feel like this will be a... Oh, I just noticed that some of the layering has shown off where the candies are in that situation. That's a bit of a bummer. You don't want to mix up that. Have a mistake there. Alright, we're going to keep on rolling through here. We're at 71, meaning that there's just 8 more candies left. 9 more, I should say. 8, 7. Alright, so we did miss a couple th going through here. Let's go left and right and see if I can find those last remaining 6 candies. Maybe I did see them when I clicked on them. They didn't register. It's hard to say for sure. There's one there. 5 remaining. So it's a franchise, a series, uh, an experience of searching and finding that I think we all can appreciate a little wearing of Waldos or other such things. But you want to have that accuracy. I do feel that the candies are very distinct, which is both a good and bad for the experience because you are just looking for a higher area of detail and it doesn't really matter too much otherwise. Uh, these cups are actually wrong. They would come down the other way. Um, and pick up water, so that is unfortunate that they have their engineering mixed up on that situation, but, you know, what can you do? This is a candy land, maybe it has candy rules when it comes to how they expect their mechanics to work. All right, we have one remaining candy, which is right there. There we go. We have found all the candies. We have searched all candies. Cheers. Cheers.